journey it's Tuesday I'm going to pick up my cleanse from kaleidoscope so I'm gonna bring you along of what I'm doing I'm gonna do all the things and I'm gonna vlog it three-day juice cleanse get ready it's gonna be amazing okay let's go okay so if you've never been to kaleidoscope this is in the Optima and it's super cute and fire in here and how cute is this juice bar kaleidoscope Obsessed. okay Okay, so I'm doing a juice cleanse. This is day or the night before the juice cleanse. I just had a really yummy dinner. And for those of you who don't know Kaleidoscope, it is a local organic juice shop for day one. And then this is gonna be day two, day three. Um, and I can definitely supplement with like bone broth and if I get hungry, it's fine. But I'm gonna take you through each juice as I drink it and before and after, okay? And I'll tell you, I'll be transparent. How much weight did I lose? This is not a weight loss, but this is a gut reset. Um, I'm gonna be exercising very lightly and then I am also going to be doing a lot of like lymphatic drainage work, sauna steam, red light therapy, oil pulling, charcoal. So I'll kind of take you through the whole the whole routine of what I'm gonna do. Of course, Ethan probably thinks I'm freaking nuts, but he's used to it by now. I've been really into washing, so my face is super oily, but yeah, I'm so excited. There are so many of these juices that I've tried, um, and there's so many juices that I haven't tried, but I am going to give you the full rundown of why I'm doing this, um, how, why it's beneficial to help reset, um, via juice and I'll kind of give you that in a minute. Okay, juice number one. I'm gonna have some right now. I am a little hungry, so this is just my starter. Then I'll do my breakfast juice, but I'm gonna go treat a patient right now, so. Yeah. Okay, it's almost noon and I'm just finishing my first juice. I'm kind of behind schedule, but I've been treating patients all day. The next juice is Trinity, which is organic kale, spinach, parsley, turmeric, ginger, lemon, celery, and cayenne. I'm on a ginger thing today. Mmm, it's really good. This is technically the breakfast smoothie, or juice. Mm -hmm. Good. Okay, I am on the third juice. This is called Holy Basil. And it's Holy Basil, basil, spinach, cucumber, chlorophyll, apple, and lime. This is delicious, a little bit on the sweeter side. This is okay, I am going to be on my fourth juice and it is four o'clock, so. This one's called Gold. Gold. It is apple, lemon, ginger, and cayenne. This is kind of like your little treat. Ooh, delicious. 
Okay, you guys, I am on the crown, which is carrot, apple, ginger, and lemon. A lot of apple today. I have one more juice after this, my nighttime juice. And then I'm going to bed. I'll probably have some ginger, I'll have some tea. And that will be that on that. This is good. Really good. This is day two of the juice cleanse. I am drinking some more lemon water. Have a nice roll in front of the red light. So I'm going to face the red light and just do some ice rolling. But, okay, so I weighed myself just because I was curious. And I don't, this is all like water and food weight, but it, like just after one day, like five pounds. Just boom. It's crazy. And I was drinking juice all day. My stomach. I'm not hungry. I'm not. So I'm gonna turn this on. Day two with the turmeric flush. So this is the same drink every morning. So how am I feeling? I'm a little bit hungry, but nothing too crazy. Got to really shake this well. So this is again, this is turmeric, ginger, lemon cayenne and water. I'm feeling a little hungry, but I actually feel like I have a ton of energy this morning. Juice number two of day two of the juice cleanse. This is the Trinity from Kaleidoscope Juice. It is kale, spinach, parsley, turmeric, ginger, lemon, celery, and cayenne. Definitely has a celery kick to it. I'm doing fine. I'm not hungry. I'm thinking about food because it's lunchtime, but this was supposed to be my breakfast smoothie or breakfast juice and it's literally noon. So I have to catch up on my juices. This is delicious. I've been seeing patients all day. I'm just, I don't have any gaps today in my schedule. Okay. Watermelon flush is next. Watermelon with the rind with lemon and mint. This could be my favorite one. This is so good. I'll finish this later. I'm gonna drink this later finish it later. Aloha! Okay, this is my next juice. Spirulina, pineapple, aloe vera, watercress, collard greens, and lime. Definitely my least favorite. It's got a weird like twang to it, but it's good. Oh, I forgot to record. I am, this is still day two. This was my fifth drink. This was um, Dusty Beet, and this is really good. It was, where is the, organic red beet, organic celery, green apple, spinach, lemon, and ginger. Delicious. And then this is my dinner one, and this is called the Emerald. I had this last night. Cucumber, spinach, ginger, lime, cilantro, parsley, and chlorophyll. So good. The skin is skinning. I feel like I'm glowing from these juices. Okay, good morning. This is day three of the juice cleanse and I'm feeling good. I weighed myself this morning. Again, this is not about weight loss, but I think like another few pounds. So I think it's all water weight, but my stomach, I should show you guys. I should do, I think I have a before picture. It's feeling just really good. No bloating. 
stretching my back and my knee and then I'm gonna go do the steam room and um, I'm gonna go walk for a little bit. I have a busy day today. I go see my physical therapist today. The juice cleanse is like, it's all mental, like because I'm not hungry. It's crazy. Because you start to, you just think about food a lot because we're so conditioned that we need to eat all the time. It's just been a weird transition. So I'm doing fine. Like it's not a big deal actually. It's, yeah, it's really not. I'm actually going to roll my gut. I don't know if you guys have ever seen this, but so this is like a stomach massage, but we have ascending colon, transverse colon, descending colon. So you actually lay on the ball and kind of mobilize all through here. And then you kind of go through here and try to move down. It's just some more intense um, gut massage. So when I teach abdominal like colon massage, we think of I. So this is the letter I, L, and then U. So we call it the I love you massage. So I'm gonna do that right now in front of the red light and just finding those tender points and holding in deep breathing. So I'll show you what that looks like. That little devil. So here. So you kind of sink into the ball. If you're pregnant, you don't want to do this. Or if you're newly postpartum, do not do this. This is just to help the moving stool and then you kind of roll up. Okay, it's day three of the juice cleanse, last day. I'm feeling like really good, a lot of good energy. Um, I started my morning with hot lemon water every morning, so eight to six ounces of hot lemon water. Then I do I do ginger tea by Puka, P-U-K-K-A, um, three ginger organic. It's really, really good. And then I will start with my first juice. So again, this first juice, the turmeric flush, every, and I'm really excited. Um, I have pooped every morning, and which has been really nice, and even though I'm not eating, so I'm getting cleaned out. Okay, day three of the juice cleanse, and I just finished Trinity. This was kale, spinach, parsley, turmeric, ginger, lemon, celery, and cayenne. Delicious. I'm going to physical therapy right now. So this is my second juice of the day, and it's only... It's almost 1.30, so I need to get to drinking. I have a few more I need to get going on. Today is the last full day of the juice cleanse, so I'm excited to eat some food tomorrow. So I will bring you on the eating the food journey tomorrow because um, I'm going to do no meat tomorrow. Just pretty much plant-based because that is the that is what they recommend is just doing like a lot of fruits and vegetables. Uh, my third juice and we are doing the Conquer the World. Okay, this is red beet, carrot, apple, ginger, and lemon. And it's really good. I've, as you can see, I've almost finished it. it. Makes your teeth red. Conquer the World. I am. One step at a time, baby. Guys, I'm actually just like not hungry, really. I promise. I'm not lying to you. If I can do this, you can do this. I feel really good. Like, juice is powerful. Well, what I wanted to say is I made sure this I was doing this during a power phase, meaning I just finished ovulation. And so right after ovulation, before you go into your luteal phase, so you like, you have this like, from day 16 to day 19 of your cycle, it's called the power phase. And you can do like really big fasts, you can do a little bit more intense exercise. And so when we're gonna stress the um, system, you wanna be you wanna be a, in your cycle, you wanna be a place in your cycle where you can handle it. Like you would not wanna do a fast during in your luteal phase. So I made sure I timed this perfectly. So yeah. 
Okay, this is my juice number four. This is the Valley. Valley is cucumber, green apple, lime, collard greens, kale, parsley, basil, and spinach. All right, it is 4.30. I'm gonna go treat a patient at five here. It's Friday. I'm nearing the end of the juice cleanse. All right, you guys, I had my final juice of the three-day cleanse. I'm gonna take my activated charcoal tonight. I've been taking two capsules every night. And this was the Trinity. It is um, kale, spinach, parsley, turmeric, ginger, lemon, celery, and cayenne. So that's a wrap on the juice cleanse. I'm gonna wake up tomorrow. I'm not exactly sure. I have a workout scheduled, but let me show you. This completes the blends here are all the bottles I will check in tomorrow let you guys know how I feel let you know how much weight I lost again it's it's all water weight it's not really I mean I'm not what well it's weight but like it is, it is a lot of water weight it is okay I'm not gonna knock it down all right but I haven't had any gas and I've had normal poops Ethan, have you heard me fart the past three days? Oh my god, you're right. You can shit it up. You can fart it at all. Yeah. It's insane. What the hell? It's crazy. I usually have pretty not it's great. Continuous farts. It's pretty bad gas. And I Yeah, it's, it's insane. The past three days I haven't had any of that, so. Guys, this is I'm um, the juice cleanse is done. Woohoo! Ethan and I are gonna go for a walk. Um, I wish I would have taken before and afters of my She's stomach. Good. But I feel less bloated. Everything. My back kind of feels like less thick. I don't know how to explain it, but here's my tum. Get it. like get stuck in our intestinal lining and like it can be directly related to like your skin or weight gain or bloat or gas and like we know something's wrong so sometimes it is really important to do a cleanse we don't cleanse and we don't like reset sometimes whether that's like with fasting or what have you it just like starts to build and build and build and that's why like i am a believer in intermittent fasting not all the time but like doing like a 24 hour fast here and there, I really think is so powerful just to let your gut just rest and chill out because it's constantly working. Think about it, you for the past 30 years and 30 years old, like you just never stopped eating food. It's constant and just giving our gut a break. It's been really, really healing, um, I think. And my skin looks good. I haven't had any bloating, any gas, like Ethan's like, oh my gosh, that's crazy. You're like not farting. <laughs> Um, pooping normal like my poops look so good so normal in the mornings which is awesome juicing can really help with energy it can help with digestion 
It can help with um, weight loss, kickstarting your metabolic system, but it is really helpful reset. So let me tell you some things that what I did. So in the morning I would wake up and I would get in front of my red light and I did some ice rolling. So I, I put some rosehip oil on my face and I was ice rolling in front of a red light. And then in the morning I would do just light cardio at the gym and then go into the sauna, sweat out for like 15 minutes, and then steam room, um, sweat out, and just do like some deep breathing. And then I went to work, and then I started the morning with hot lemon water. So about 16 ounces of hot water with lemon, and then I had um, organic ginger tea. And then around like nine, I had my first juice. So started the morning with the turmeric flush juice. And then um, the first juice was your breakfast juice after that. This is a green juice, no sugar. Um, and then I had another green juice for um, lunch and then a, another green juice for um, dinner. But then I had two in between that could be more fruit based. So then I really didn't get hungry. I think I didn't feel hungry, I just felt like I missed chewing on something. And really, I was telling Ethan, like, everyone should do it. Because it really builds, like, it makes you realize we go to the grocery store and we buy so much food. And, like, it's just so unnecessary, all the things that we're, like, we are buying, like, trying. Like, all these brands are making so many different versions of all the things. It's just like, why? Let's just eat the real thing. Like, why are we trying to like make something, I don't know, like all these different creamers and gluten-free breads and it's just like if we just stuck to meat, veggies, protein and just made food and less is so much more and I feel like by doing this I've, it's made me realize like I, half of the time I'm not even hungry, I'm just bored. Like I'm just like okay, I'm bored, like no. And we go to restaurants and they cook our food in like the worst shit and then we feel so sick. It's been a really good reset, no caffeine I didn't have. Um, and then at night what I would do is I'd come home from work and then I would do more oil on my face and do a gua sha routine to my face using a rose quartz gua sha tool. And so at night time I was taking organic coconut oil activated charcoal um, and you can get these on Amazon the brand is S-C-H-I-Z-A-N-D-U um, and this is by plant I-F-I-Q-U-E it's really cute it's like 15 bucks um, I was doing castor oil packages. You can get this off Amazon or just like at Sprouts Castor Oil. The brand is Heritage Store. You put this all on your stomach and then you can put, um, if you look up on Amazon, it's just like this cloth thing at night. You just put it on there and you can put your heating pad on there. It just helps pull toxins out. And then this is the um, rosehip oil I use. It's by C-L-I-G. And I see how I'm gonna move forward. So today I'm gonna eat a full vegetarian diet, so just plant-based today. And then um, moving forward, I'm gonna just slowly add foods back in. So um, overall, I lost I would say eight pounds, but a lot of it was just like water and inflammation because the past all the gas and bloat like I had the past three days or the, a week before I started this I was having so much gas and bloat like my weight was just higher because I, I don't think I was pooping I was kind of constipated so I probably really only lost five pounds but it, from when I stepped on the scale till now it was about like seven or eight pounds um I don't know I feel like I look the same besides my stomach um just as like a lot flatter and just more I just felt better. It's not about weight loss. It really isn't. It's about getting my gut back on track. But I know a lot of people want to do it to kickstart weight loss because this can. I feel like sometimes if you're stuck at a number and you're like, I am doing everything I possibly can and I can't lose weight, sometimes you just have to reboot the system and this could be the trick. 
A lot of people also recommend getting colonics after doing a juice cleanse like this. I actually have one scheduled for next weekend, but that's it. And I hope this was informative. If you have any questions, DM me at Badash. All right, that's it. I'll see you guys. Bye.